Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by to watch another video. I hope everyone is doing okay today. I wanted to share some clean and simple thank you cards that I created. All I did was some stamping, some die cutting, and there's no coloring in this card. The stamp and die that I use is this one right here. I got this from AC Moore and it's by Love Nicole. I think that's one of their local brands. I use these card bases from Recollections. They have the little Swiss dots and I found these at Tuesday morning. The number is 2152735. I also use some white cardstock for three of my other bases. And then I use this DCWV Corrigan Neutral Stack. I got that from Tuesday morning and I've also found this at Joann's. And then for my background paper, I use this Park Lang Happy Day. This is from um, Joann's and this is a 6x8 paper pad. And I also use this Hot by Paper Pad and this is called Embossed Brights. And what it is, is it's pastel colors but they have embossing textures on them. So here's one of the first little cards that I created. I did a stitched oval and then a um, this is a stitched scallop oval and then I did a regular stitched oval in the center I did some sequins scattered around I cut the ice cream cone out in the corrugate board and then the top of the cone um, the ice cream I stamped on that um, embossed paper the hot buy and then just cut it out on the bottom I just have some pieces that I had previously cut and I just stamped scoops and scoops of thanks and there's some little sequins on there and then the top is a stitched oval it says yours the sweetest with the little cherries and that comes from that same stamp set here's another one it also had the sentiment you're the coolest and then this one and this is another little die from my stash that was previously cut and then on my white card bases I just did the sequence all around this was also something that I had punched out that's actually a punch and um that's some um, I think that's Echo Park Easter paper but I thought that brightened up the card. This is one of those hot buy papers that I had previously cut. And then here's the last one that I created. And none of the insides are finished out because I wanted to personalize the messages based on who they were going to. Again, these are some clean and simple thank you cards that I created. If you have any questions, please leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you all so much for watching and have a great day. Bye.